Oh hell yeah, Bethesda has finally announced that Doom will release May 13th on PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. And that's not all, as the company is releasing a premium collector's edition that comes with a 12-inch statue of the Revenant Demon, unrelated to Leonardo DiCaprio by the way, and a metal case. So yeah, we only have a few months till we can literally chainsaw demons in half, spraying blood everywhere. Delightful, isn't it? Sony has unveiled a new special edition PlayStation 4, this time with everybody's favorite hero with a half-tucked shirt, Nathan Drake. Now Drake does look a bit sad on the system, but there's no doubt the Uncharted 4 bundle will make any fan happy. It comes with a copy of the game, a special gray-blue 500GB system, and matching controller all for $400. I gotta say, the limited edition console is a looker, like my boy Drake, so let me know in the comments below if you plan on picking it up. Praise the sun, because new Dark Souls 3 gameplay footage has leaked. And many people are spotting some similarities between the upcoming game and from software's last title, the PlayStation 4 exclusive, Bloodborne. For instance, Dark Souls 3 looks to sport a more active combat system. Don't worry, I'm sure you'll still die a ridiculous amount of times. Because that's fun to a lot of you, not me. Because my definition of fun is playing Mario Kart and eating pizza. It's cool though, different strokes from different folks. All right, you all can't get enough Grand Theft Auto V because Take-Two Interactive has now sold over 60 million freaking copies of the game. Yes, I said 60 million. Yes, that's a lot. And that means Grand Theft Auto V has sold 6 million copies in the past six months, even though the open world game originally launched back in 2013. Needless to say, Take-Two is pretty happy about this since the crazy sales for GTA V led to a stronger than expected third quarter for the company. In other words, they got lots of money. And that's your daily fix for February 4th. I'm Naomi Kyle, and remember you can get your fix anytime online at IGN.